This is a video on how to use the OCSB student portals. The first thing that I'm going to do to locate the student portals is head to the OCSB.ca website. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to scroll down to the bottom until I see JK to six or seven to 12 students. Depending on the age of your child, select the appropriate student portal. In this case, this is the K to six student portal and the seven to 12 student portal will look very similar um, to the K to six. The next thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to ensure that you're signed in properly. Currently, I'm using a Chromebook to demonstrate on this video. I am going to select one of the Google tools such as Google Drive. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to notice my profile circle in the corner. I'm going to click on that profile circle. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to ensure that this is at the top here, student5 at stu.ocsb.ca. That will need to be done on a Chromebook. On a laptop, there will be two profile circles. There will be one here. Ensure that you're signed in with your STU account, but you also want to make sure that this additional profile circle is also signed in with the STU account. If I click there, I notice that this stu.ocsb.ca account is signed in and this sync is on. If you're using a PC or a laptop, you need to be using the Chrome web browser and those two things need to be on. If you need to add in an account, make sure you click here and go through the add process. And when it asks you to sync and link your account, click I am in and yes, sync. So we need to make sure the sync is on for a PC, laptop, MacBook. Once I'm ensured that I'm signed in properly to my Chromebook, I have an array of tools at my disposal, including Hopper dashboard and Hopper work, uh, student dashboard and workspace. So I can click there and it's gonna sign me in. Again, if you notice these things aren't working, I would make sure that you are signed in properly. So that is a quick demonstration of using the OCSB student portal. Thanks so much for listening.